Hey guys, hope you're all doing great. So I have here with me the NB Miner. So I did a review on this. Uh, these guys have been doing amazing updates to LHR unlocks. Uh, last thing, the last revision I did, I think, was 29.4 or 5. However, now the latest one is 29.6, uh, which has uh, an improvement on the LHR unlock feature. Uh, so basically, uh, if you have a 360 Ti, uh, I did a review of this uh, with the last uh, with the with this card as well. I was getting maybe 40, 41. However, with these uh, uh, with the new version of MB Miner, you can get up to 45 mega hash with only increasing the core clock of the memory to uh, 1200 on Windows 10. Um, there's quite a few features, however, uh, this latest version of 9.6 is uh, more stable compared to the last version of MB Miner. So, if you do have uh, 360 Ti, I highly recommend that you update to this uh, version. Uh, I'm going to show you real quick how to add this into a uh, nice hash. And uh, so the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and download uh, the version Windows 10. Uh, you, you just have to unzip it here. And once you unzip it here, you have those files here. So you just have to click Ctrl A, copy this, and then you have to go open NB Miner. So once you have here the, uh, not the quick miner, the regular MB miner, you go to plugins and you just head to MB miner here. It'll show 16.4 uh, latest installed, however, this includes uh, 39.5. Uh, what you want to do is want to update this to 29.6 to get the best um, uh, the best version of NB miner. So you go to bin, you go here, if you have all the versions, you have a few versions of this. So you just have to focus on 16.4. You click on this here and you paste everything. Um, back here. Uh, once you paste that and you run the miner, you all should have now the latest version of uh, of MB miner here. So you'll run at uh, 39.6 here. And uh, you, uh, I've been running this for a while. Uh, I've been having a very stable uh, hash rate here. So I do have now the recording software. But I've been getting around the 42.7, 43 on on this card. And uh, yeah, like it's much improvement from the last one. I think last one was uh, 41. I was getting, and now as you can see here, you have the updated version of uh, 39.6. So this is how you update this with nice hash, and you can have the dashboard uh, right into it. You don't need to run the minor files by itself. You can integrate this to nice hash the easy way, and you should be able to get up to 40, uh, 42, 43, like I mentioned. I'm running here the recording software, so I'm getting less. However, I did notice one. Uh, one perfect improvement is that at least now the hash rate was is stable. Before, uh, I noticed with NB Miner, with the versions older than 29.6, the ease to play a lot, it goes up and down all the time. So, uh, with this at least, you're gonna, I was getting 42.7 uh, and it's uh, super stable. So, uh, I hope uh, you like this video. Uh, please menu, let me know what you think. Uh, so, uh, just to show you real quick my overclock settings before I log off. Um, here I'm having 1200 on the uh, memory clock, minus 200 on the core clock, and power limit of 60%. Uh, you can run this uh, like the recommended on the settings here, uh, just with increasing the memory clock to 1200. However, I did notice that uh, you uh, use a lot more watt, and it's not worth it for a few mega hashes. So I do recommend you to, to power limit this to 60%, and uh, you're gonna get uh, stable results now of 42 uh, with the card. Uh, this is with the uh, gigabyte model. And uh, however, if you have a different card, you can get to up to 45 theoretical value. This is the, what they're mentioning. So uh, let me know what you guys are, are getting. So uh, I hope this liked you this quick video. Please uh, like and subscribe and have a great weekend.